Hello. First, I would like to start off with a thanks to all the people that have subscribed to the channel. We only started this channel a little over a month ago, and it's already at 143 subscribers. So thanks for that. Very epic. Welcome to devlog number 6. So as we said in a comment last week, I forgot to show off the dialogue thing that we made. As you can see from this first version of it, it was very ugly, mainly because I hadn't messed with the colors yet to make it look better. This is probably the final version. I may tweak some things, but it looks good for now. The next thing that was done is my friend implemented some pathfinding into the enemies. It works pretty well, but there are some things that we need to fix, such as if you spawn too many enemies, they will all get stuck on each other, which is also why I redid the bridge. I would also like to address a comment that I got asking who we is. Like when I mention we were working on this or that, I'm talking about me and my friend. My friend is the coder and I am the artist. Also, this code in the background is for our wave difficulty thing that we are adding so that every wave is harder than the one before that and it will keep increasing in difficulty. My friend also told me to add in that he knows the code is inefficient and wants to use overridable functions but doesn't exactly know how they work yet and also the code probably shouldn't affect performance that badly. We also have a Patreon. There are two tiers, so if you care to support us and the game development, then go check those out. I also want to thank the two patrons, an apple in a box, and ducky on quack for supporting the game development. Another comment that I got was asking for me to explain the game, so for the people that didn't see Devlog 4, our game is named Last Hope. It is going to be a defense game where you defend the village as you are their last hope for survival. There will be waves of enemies every night that get harder and harder each night until you get overrun for now, but eventually there may be a way to escape, but not right now. I also made these three animations for the character that will be for when the character is moving down on the screen. And I made some animations for the bigger and smaller wood enemies, which I've showed off in the Discord, which has 15 people in it now. So if you want to join that and talk about things or maybe show off stuff you were working on, then the link is in the description. As you can see, each time a wave spawns, it spawns more enemies and more difficult enemies the more waves that you spawn. Okay, so thanks for watching the video, and thanks again to everybody that has subscribed, and to the patrons. Please leave any suggestions for us in the comments about the game or the devlogs, and if you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing. It helps a lot. Have a good day, and goodbye.